Hey, and Maroka leveled up. Sweet. Okay, so we've got a whole other floor of just all these ebbs and flows. Ah, Maroka, level up. You are going to get... Mm, I'm going to go with... Vitality or Agility? I think we'll go with Agility. Just keep you kind of balanced. So which way do we want to go off of here? That didn't take me where I wanted to be. So we've got that one. Found a treasure box, which is butterfly powder. Sweet. So that's where we're going to end up there. Let's go ahead and fight all the things down here and see what kind of enemies we have to deal with. It looks like it's just the same enemies. Level 40. That's going to suck a little bit. We need higher agility. That was a good hit, Wander. Jeez, 266. So I think this is where we want... Oh, Rotting Corpse. Check it out. It's going to be... Um, you find a note. We finally got the palace's permission to search the Mausoleum of the Sea. Boss thinks there's some sort of important secret here. Don't know if I buy that. Anyway, my investigation confirmed one thing so far. All sorts of things gather in the places with flowing water. If you look closely and pay attention, you're likely to see something interesting. Things gather in the places with the flowing water? Um, let's go there. Ooh, that's another thing I want. I want this. Check it out. Appears to be the remains of an adventurer. Unfortunately, their weapons are rusted. Blah, blah, blah. What does it have? A shining necklace. No doubt some sort of magic was responsible for the pristine condition. Could it be one? Yep, it is one of the rare items. Hey, we got Maid Joker. So we've gotten three of the magic items. I want to go to there. Did we actually? Yay, we got it. Okay, so we've got this one. Let's go ahead and power up the warp stone. So we can just come down here. Sea Cavern 100M in the Mausoleum of Sea can now be accessed from the map. Yay! Don't touch it yet. So we can now go through that one. Um, I should probably honestly go back and save. But we'll, we'll figure that out in a little bit. We'll see if these guys' little friend shows up. Because there's two bosses down here that we want to kind of fight. And if we fight them and lose a bunch of guys, we, we, can, we can grind to recover. I'm not completely without capabilities there. It's just we don't want to lose their last life point. Is there anything here? Nope. So let's see. Map-wise, it looks like... Yeah, this is just going to be a one area thing. So it's not going to be that bad. Let's go ahead and map those. I'm going to go save real quick. Because we have the opportunity. No sense to waste the exploration that we've already done. And we also get to sell the random crap that we found. Odd undies. Oh, revealing cloth. We've already gotten that before. More ice vials. More rainbow vials. Those are good. Let's go Stranger Base and Stranger Guild. And, oh. Oh, we near the edge of the corridor, you bump into someone unexpected. Pardon me? It's the old man. What? Is that? It's that strange old man. Hi, old guy. Oh, would you look at that? It's wonderful to see you doing well. Quite tragedy of you, dirt. Hmm. What do you want? Oh, how cruel you are. I got word one of your allies vanished. I traveled all this way to offer some flowers. And now that I look at you, the Elder stares closely, um, you've become quite the stranger. Uh, it's much better to forge a soul of steel. However, at this point, it would be quite a shame to let your power go to waste. I don't trust you. Merely listen. Strangers have no future, you see. Think for just a moment. Would a resident of this world truly be concerned over the fate of outsiders? Even if one claims to do so, they're no, no doubt a hypocrite. Oh, God. You're a dirty old man, aren't you? The attack here is referred to by many as an unfortunate accident. How utterly foolish. One by one, they'll pick off those who stand in their way. Do nothing, and that night will be next. But even at your current strength, you won't be able to stop them. If anything could change your fate, then that would be power. A strength that overwhelms this world. A master of sorcery who can possess each vessel with ease. It's only once that power is realized that strangers may escape their yoke. You, Alania, shall become that master. Um, that's plain crazy. Truth cannot be easily found. 
Those who harp upon its virtue are merely devils in disguise. I'm afraid there's no other choice in the matter. Either you take my humble advice or you wander this land for eternity. Come to the Mausoleum of Metal, the place we first met. A fitting location, is it not? Oh, so we have even more things. I think we're going to keep exploring the water. That Okay, so the Elder's gone. Land of Origin, sweet. More story. <laughs> we'll go there later. Shop, sell garbage, trade items, yes. Sell items from bag, we've got... Rusty Axe, Curing Wand will keep, Fire Rod will sell, Revealing Cloth will sell, Made Joker 11,000, sure, we'll sell it. And then we'll store any excess items we have. We, we might be bringing more wands with us later. We need those gone. Treant Wand, we don't need an extra one of right now, but we'll use it later. System save there. And Butterfly Powder is just to uncurse things. Um, if we wanted to, we could bring it with to uncurse the rods, but I think we have enough items to kind of cover that gap. So we've saved. We can go to Ghost Town there. I'm surprised we haven't gotten anything in Upper Division yet. So... No, we're going to the sea. We want to finish exploring this place. We need to stop getting distracted by Ushinies. So that's that. No, I don't want to touch it. Don't. No, I don't want to touch it. Okay, so where we want to go next is... We've got enemies there. We've got enemies there. We want to either go up into this area. I think we want to finish exploring this floor because there's plenty that we haven't seen. So that is... Yeah, there's plenty of ground we haven't seen too. So I'm going to go this way. I'm going to go off this side. No, it just loops us back in? Okay. Okay, so that takes us to this. That takes us back. That takes us here, which is a place we haven't been... Oh, hey, we can probably hide here. We can! We can actually go fight one of those buggers. So let's do that real quick. Let's see if we can fight a Kraken guy. Okay. Yeah, we'll fight you. Check enemy, level 28. Yeah, we can take you. I find the massive list of stuff on his setup to be disconcerting, though. So concentrate. Uh, carnage front. Skill, clock up, and fight. Okay, you're going to do... Soul Blast. And now, um, Grayson will not lose levels whenever he starts getting whacked around uh, by bosses. He doesn't have to lose them until he gets up into the 20s. And as a cleric, he's going to be able to get up to uh, some trouble as well each time he levels up. And he's only level 11, so he can get a lot of stuff going. So we killed one Kraken. We need to kill a few Krakens. Said anywhere up to five? So let's go ahead and get rid of the worst one down here is going to be poison gas. Hey, it's a mimic trap. Great. That's more more items for us. Level 38 mimic. Great. Um, you're not going to carnage rent. You're going to just straight up go for them. Clock up and a fight. And you're actually going to clock up fast item. Let's go for which one's strong versus water. I think it's thunder rod. So we're going to go thunder. Clock up. Fast item, you're going to Thunder Rod as well. Just be cracking on those Krakens. The Kraken! <laughs> uh, how's it going, Locke? We're just going after this giant... Oh yeah, this is not a water guy. This is literally just a Mimic. Ow, ow, ow. Stop, please. God, don't insta-kill me. Rush, fight... Fight. Defend. Fight. Awake, you guess? Wow, we are not hitting for anything. Please stop. Thank you. Let's go ahead and Divinity and Sky Dragon. Actually, I think we Holy Light. No, we Sky Dragon too. First. Concentrate. Fight. Clock up. Fight. Skill. Lock up. Fast item. 
Okay, how many Thunder Rods do we have left? Did one of, yeah, one of them corrupted. So, let's go for a Fire Rod. And you fight. Bonk, bonk. Gloomhaven. Yeah, um, I don't own it, unfortunately. I was actually invited to play that as well. Um, a while back, actually, now that I think about it. And we didn't get any item... Hmm, game. Okay, so curing wands on you. We need to top you guys off so you're not, like, just getting completely destroyed. Let's go ahead and hide again. It says it can take up to five Krakens. Krakens? We're going to pass on you guys, because what we want is Krakens. Hey! Hi, big and ugly. Mithril Hammer, Soldier Helmet, 5k Page Grimoire. You slay enough of the Kraken race and hide the ultimate Kraken will appear. Get revenge for the Knight's General. Okay. We'll fight it. This will give us another skill thing, though, at least. But yeah, it, it looks like a fun game. I just need to get it eventually. So let's go ahead and check enemy. So 35 and 30. Yeah, we'll go ahead and fight. We're going to have to restrict levels. Yep, anyone over level 17 is going to get dropped down. No! Thankfully, we only lose one level on Alani and we lose none on Grayson. Skill. Ooh, you could Holy Weapon. Not really worth it, but that's fine. Uh, Divinity. We definitely want to do a Holy Light 2. Fight the big guy, skill, concentrate, and you're going to do Assault Slash 2, Clock Up, and you can't Fast Spell, but you can do Fast Item. So let's go ahead and Treant Wand you. Clock Up, Fast Item, this guy's going to be Water Based, I think. So Small Thunder Vial. Fast Item, you're going to Small Thunder Vial as well. Boom. There you go. Eat all that. There's real damage. Okay, so... Oh, nice. 42 damage. So, you fight. You go ahead and rush. You go ahead and assault slash. And we're just going to use Thunder Vials. For the most part, I think. Yep, just keep using the Thunder Vials. And we have the... Do we not have... I thought we had something to keep us from getting kidnapped. But I guess... I don't see it in here. I guess it just automatically procs whenever they get kidnapped? I could be wrong. There we go. Just keep nuking them. Keep bashing the giant guy. Yes. Oh, Jesus. Stop wailing on him, please. So, you need to go ahead and concentrate. You need to assault slash two again. Yeah, there's still a just normal Kraken behind him. A Kraken. Clock up. Skill. Fast item. You get to go ahead and use a regular curing wand on you. Um, Let's go ahead and clock up fast item you can play the squishy tank scoundrel who's supposed to be a thief but ended up being the party's shield and now the idiot tank brute <laughs> playing as one of the shields so you're basically the two shields um, I'm gonna go for you're gonna go for more thunder vials you're actually going to use fast item again and I'm gonna have you use Uh, curing wands as well on him. Just to cap him out. Wow. It borked. That is going to be bad for Grayson. Grayson might die here. Okay, so he didn't. Skill, rush, skill, assault slash two. Item, use. We need a better heal on you. Uh, potion uses just cure. Um, let's use a 
fairy medicine with you. You're going to use a fairy medicine as well. Just use three fairy medicines? Yeah. We could use a curing wand. Or do we do... Where is it? Hmm. Let's go ahead and just do the multi-gear. What were you set to use over here? For some reason, I think we were on the wrong one. We're going to just use Spirit Nuts. Multi-cure! Nice big rush on him. And more? Yes. I don't care that they're not affected. We're healing up. So Divinity is at full. So let's go ahead and do a... Sky Dragon 2, I believe, is going to be the nice thing. Yeah, I, I don't usually play tank classes either, so... I'm usually... Whenever I play Mage, I play the Illusionist, if that tells you anything. I don't... I'm not a big direct combat kind of person in games. So you go ahead and... Actually, you defend. I'm going to see if I can pull that in on you. I really... I can't wait until we get Ranger, because Ranger apparently has a way to see the enemy life. So we'd actually know how close we are to being able to kill these things. So let's go with... I'm slightly curious how the Holy Vial works, but I'm going to go with... I'm going to have him do... Fire Vial, I think. Actually, no, you do Rainbow Vial. It's a little bit more chaotic, but it's fine. Skill, Fast Item. You need to do the Thunder Vial. Skill, fast item, and you need to do... We don't have any high avoid things. Well, there isn't an alternate for combat in MWO. You have to fight. <laughs> uh, okay. Your default role you think is DPS kind, hit for damage as much as possible, and leaves the tanking and healing to people who know how to focus on it. Um, Let's see. I will go for... Do we need Curing Wand at all? I don't think so. I think we just need to use the Thunder Rods. There you go. I'm surprised that back guy is not dead. Because he has taken a lot of damage. Okay, a little bit of damage to everybody. Kraken's not moving at all. You defend. You go ahead and rush. You go ahead and Assault Slash. You go ahead and f you're going to use a... You're going to fight. Just straight up fight it. You are going to go ahead and item use... Go ahead and use a Thunder Rod. Down to two of them? Yuck. Item use... You're going to use one of the seeds. No, you're going to use the nut. Spirit Nut. Just to top them off a little bit. Okay, so K Kraken is race resting. Sky Dragon 2 wears off. Um, Yeah, you keep defending. Actually, do you have... No, you don't. Defend. Concentrate. Assault Slash 2. Oh, there's more back there. Good lord, how many of you are there? Skill. Fast item. Thunder Raw. Actually, no. You just fight. Clock up. Fast item. More thunder. That's actually... Yeah, we'll keep with the thunder raw, um, thunder vials for him. Or her, sorry. She does a lot more damage with them than the others. Fast item, thunder rod from you. It does a bit of damage. You can see it's doing 79 to the one and back. I'm really surprised that second one is not... Oh, it finally died. Okay. Hey, we stunned, big boy. So that means divinity time. Divinity into... Sky Dragon 2. Fight. Rush. Go ahead and Carnage Front. Fight. 
item use. Go ahead and use the Thunder Rod. Oh, we're almost out of Thunder Rods. No! Uh, you go ahead and fight as well. Okay, I think we killed big guy. Okay, so that's a decent amount of damage to you. Um, Carnage front on you. Go ahead and... F yeah, you're going to clock up and fight. We're not going to waste any more resources on that, so you're going to defend... Oh, you soul blast. Not waste any more resources on this. And ouch! Oh, 48 damage to you. Can move freely. Yay! And nice miss. And target level restriction was... Yay, we beat it. We beat the Kraken. We destroyed the Kraken! We felled the Kraken. And got 18,000 freaking experience from it, too. Bye, big guy. So there's one down. A Taisho helmet and a Mithril hammer. We don't know what either one of those are. And helmet worn by foreign lords. So it's probably nothing. Okay. So as far as this goes, do we know how to get back there? Yes. So we definitely want to save after that. A warp zone. Return to the city. Because bad things are happening. That and we used up a lot of our little lightning things. And we got junk. Oh, a morning star. Absorb damage 2%. An evening star and a morning star. Cute. Cute. I get the joke there. Both of them are kind of garbage. I mean, they do a lot of damage. Don't get me wrong. It's just, they're kind of garbage. So, party member, you go ahead and we can actually swap over to this. And if you need to do more damage, we could just do... How much are those? Uh, vitality requirement. We could throw him on him. And that would be a lot of damage compared to the heresy. Because the heresy is only at 100 for him. So that is... Oh, that's a two-hander. That's why it's so much damage. Okay. It's just a big wacky stick. Let's see what we've got. I need to go to the base and get my money. Yep. And you need to level up, Weirtha. So you're going to go with uh, more int. Just to keep your MP growth up to a reasonable amount. And any of you level up probably... Oh, you did. Sweet. Level up to 18. You get more int as well. I am slightly sad about one thing is if you don't have a reason to be getting int at the beginning, I mean, mana at the beginning, you start at, like, the base mana. So you have to, like, rebuild it all from scratch. So it seems like it would be a good idea to start everyone as clockers and just kind of go with it until you get up to, like, whatever level you want. So you have mana to be growing. So do we want to store any of this? Probably not. Sell trade items, yes. Yes. Sell items from item bag. We want to get rid of the Morning Star because it's a two-handed that's worse than the other one. Taisho Helmet can go away. Mithril Hammer. Honestly, that... Oh, Mithril Hammer is better than what he has, so that's fine. So, party member Grayson. You're actually going to get the Mithril Hammer instead. If you can equip it. Nope, it requires piety. That's why you didn't equip it. We'll store it. Store that. And let's go ahead and use that grimoire. We're going to use it on... I think we want to get her over to being a cleric as well as soon as possible. So I'm really tempted to just dump it on her. At the same time, Grayson having healing magic would be awesome. Mm, yeah, we'll just... We'll, we'll stick with the plan. Get you up to a cleric. That way we have someone else getting a, not necessarily immortal ability, but immunity to status effects. So save, yep. And then we can start working on the other ones once they get up to like their levels to switch over. 35, 35, and 30 for the two warriors and the mage. Okay, back to the sea. 
<laughs> we, we are determined to get each of them. So the other one we wanted to get down here is going... To, oh, we forgot to do something. We need to go turn in some of our stones. Stranger base, stranger guild, base... Nope. Leader's room. There you go. Give blood crystals. And here you go. The dragon of neutrality is the one we'll take. So, row of enemies, hit and avoid minus 10. So, yeah, we're just moving up this. Ooh, sky dragon, gain the initiative, stacking lengthens effect. Oh. And then we choose our destiny. So, there's king sign, dragon sign, and saint sign. But we're going to keep going along this. I said I was going to, so we're going to. Maximum morale is 60. Power up limit is increased to 27. Yay, so we can upgrade our gear even further. That's nice. That's nice and a half. Shop. No, not shop. We want to go to system. Save. Save that. So we're looking okay. So we want to go to Palace again. We'll deal with the old guy probably next stream. Not next episode, but next stream. So let's see. On this map, we have... I think we go down there first. And I want to see what this other thing that we're supposed to fight is. Lineages. Mausoleum of the Sea. So we've done those two. This one is Carving the Lakeside States. Taint the bottom of the sea with blood of the races to summon him. So he is... What was your name again? What's my name again? King of the Depths. So King of the Depths is... That is the wrong thing. Mausoleum of the Sea. So King of the Depths is 100... Oh, it's in 1000M ambush spot, so there's no way we can get to him. Same for the Living Legend. And Corpse Eating Dragon is, yeah, down into the 1000. So we just have to find our way down to fight the other three. Which is fine, I guess. Kind of crappy, but it's cool. So we really don't have much else to gain from this floor other than treasure. Uh, let's see. As far as the map goes, let's go there first. Can't find a route there. Isn't it just... How did we get there before? That popped us off, so did we... Oh, I see. We landed there. That's the initial place we started. So we are going to have to scout away to... I don't... God dang it. Don't touch it. I wish I actually had to activate touching stuff to get it to touch it. So that one goes back onto the island. So let's go all the way over to this guy and walk off. I do see that land up north. That's probably our way down. Oh, it's a Woda. This is going to be another one of those butterfly things. So you are going to need to fight. Thank you.